Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. How are you holding up in these trying times? My name is Frank. Hopefully you guys are doing well and staying safe. And I'm presenting you another video for you to have something to do this pandemic days. Uh, uh, here we go. It's another tier changes episode. We are going to be a new tier because Octavish has went up from PU to N. Now, first things, in my opinion, I think it's well deserved. Fisher's Rend is too strong for PU, and it's actually pretty decent in any. I think it is the tier this Pokemon belongs, because uh, it doesn't have strong job, uh, just like Dracovish. So that's the difference. It doesn't have the same speed. It's quite slow actually. So I think all around. I think it could be good in this tier, and people is prepared for this in any way. Not, not like not. There's a bunch of uh, bulky grass mods, bulky water mods, there's a lot of uh, water absorb Pokemon around here. So I think this thing sits in here pretty decent. Um, that's what I think overall. It was uh, kind of a hated mod in the PU tier, uh, so that's why it got banned and then raised raise from tiers so I think it's it's fair enough I don't know what you guys think though if you have more experience with the end your tier and such I would like to know what you think of this uh, but yeah Fisher's ran in the lower tiers very nice uh, the rest of move is gonna be ice cold crash psychic fangs and super fang um, super fang is useful to do damage to other actual uh, fishes that's uh, other moves that he could learn like body slam or crunch uh, facade it has a lot of moves it's Special moves too, so we could explore that at some point. And then rock moves as well, rock slide, blast, tomb, stone edge. So he has a quite a nice variety of moves in there. But I think uh, super fang for neutral heat is pretty nice. Psychic fangs uh, for extra coverage to hit uh, toxic croaks, which yes, toxic croaks is in that new steel. <laughs> and then ice cold crash, you know, stabs. And then fisher shine, of course, which is most where we will be clicking. And uh, then we do have uh, defensive. Decently fast Santa Conda. Stealth Rocks is going to be spreading glares. Now, the reason for that is to even boost a bit more Activicious power uh, to make sure even more things are able to uh, to get outsped by Activish. And then, you know, it just sheds skin rest. Uh, it's just going to set up rock to probably die. That's usually what it does. <laughs> Then we do have the classic of this channel, which is Go Guy Super with the Cold Burberry Defensive. Uh, it stops setup with foul play. It stops uh, clean clanks quite easily. Let me fix this. Hold on. Didn't see it just now. There we go. So yeah, it stops clean clank pretty easily uh, with the foul play. Uh, can break subs, and all around is pretty. Uh, it switches on knockoff so easily and tanks them so well with that massive defense. And the Cobra Berry. Very nice. And then Freeze gives us information about other mods. Then we have Rotom. It's a heavy duty boots Rotom with Defog. Uh, it does what it does. It's just offensive. Defogs and then does heavy damage to the opposing teams. Nothing too special about them. Yeah, but it's useful. Utility offense. Pretty nice. Now the, the surprise factor of this team is the second Scarfer, which is Suck. It's not very surprising to see Suck as a Scarfer, but seeing two Pokemon Scarf at the same team, some people could not expect it, and uh, you know, you can have a nice surprise with this. And plus, Suck is a classic in the end, you tier uh, as a Scarfer, it's very strong uh, for a reason. We have Close Combat, Knockoff, it's good for Clefairies, because there's Clefairies, yes. Uh, and then Earthquake and Poison Jab, also good for Clefairy. So, pretty nice coverage overall, it, it works. Uh, and the last but not least is Skunk Tank. We're gonna use a Skunk Tank once again, but this time we're using a special set, which I actually I am enjoying more than the physical set. Uh, it's kind of a mix set though, because it has Sucker Punch, I have a, a bit of attack there. Because having priority on a team is usually important. Um, but yeah, Dark Pulse, Sludge Bomb, and Flamethrower does pretty well against most of the uh, course in the tier. Uh, it's working very nice, to be honest. Uh, this team has problems with some mods like Quagsire and something like that, and Pokemons like that, but... Uh, I think we could manage. Let's go and jump for some battles and see see how we do. And how are you guys doing? You guys you guys good? You guys happy? Let me know, I guess. Not like I can do much about it, but you know. Yeah, here we go. Ooh, powerful team. Ninjas could be a problem. So I've gotta be careful with that. I'm gonna lead with Rotom 
just for that. Because uh, they may try to lead with it set up immediately and go for game. They like to do that. Uh, I don't know what rank I have in any of not. I don't have that much experience in the tier, but... 12... Nineteen. Okay, this is pretty decent. I have so many fucking tears. I could clean it up, but I kind of like having these memories in Gen 7, since I haven't cleared it up far. Pretty nice. <laughs> we only have a 61% win rate so far, so we can do better. But we'll see. I'll be leading with this. This is okay. Uh, is it TB date? I guess an air slash is pretty good against his team as he fakes out. That accomplishes not much. Uh, I don't think he will stay in. Okay, so I should protect now. I gotta go for the air slash, just maybe he thinks I'm, I'm, I'm choice. Um, and if not, yeah, there we go. And if not, there you go. He goes for the toxic. Now he can go for protect. I guess. Does it matter if he goes for protect? I guess it does, I'm gonna try to burn him. Do I want this toxic though? No. I'll bring back Rotom. Yeah, we're gonna do this. I was thinking about burning him, but uh, having this toxic so early is not very good. So it is Silvali Electric, of all things. Very interesting. Now this thing has pretty good coverage and it's usually a problem. Uh, I'm going to scum tank, expecting the ice beam I guess. But the toxic protect fucking heat on top is very annoying. I see he's special, does a bit of damage. And I guess I could just go for a nice a neutral sludge bomb, this is not gonna hurt me. So if I can weaken the Silvali, it will be very, very good. Yes indeed. I do have Sucker Punch. I get the poison so I don't have to repeat it now. Perfect. Yep. That's quite the threat. I see here comes this. Uh, sure. We're just go in the offense already. Just go into Octavius quickly. Because, yeah, I was expecting him to do that. So I'll just can spam uh, Fisher's Run. It is powerful. He's gonna protect, anyways. Uh, because they love doing that. I hate it, but. It's a useful move, gotta say. Protect is a useful move. I don't like it because I have to wait. And you know, I feel like I waste time when I play against it. But technically, it is a it is a useful move. So I can't really complain. So here's the Kofago. Let's see how much damage we can do. That's 43%. See, it's pretty impressive. Uh, now the bird is coming. I'll just try to sack Scar Tank. Maybe, yeah, maybe we can get some Dark Falls damage. On this, that'd be pretty good. Although I'm expecting another protect. As he goes into him on top, so that's good. So we get a bit of extra damage, not too much. I'm probably just gonna sag this, honestly. Like, if fake out, he's gonna get 25% damage. There you go. I'm back, I'm back again for this. I think it's actually very nice that we can go for this. Even if you take, if I wiggle this him on top. I'll be happy, because it's so fucking annoying. We're at least putting him in range of CC, or knockoff, from Sock. So there you go, that's a hit. Supposedly the defensive Pokemon. Yikes. So one of his toxic monks is ha has now been debunked, uh, which means that Gorgeist is going to be very nice blocking most of his stuff. And I think he thinks he can set up easy with this, but uh, with the Culper Berry, this thing is fairly weak. Now with the Life Orb, that does damage, it's true. But uh, this is just will o time. If he knockoffs, I mean throw chops, I'll be smiling as he goes into the Ndidi. And I'll miss the will o because why not? Why wouldn't I? <laughs> so, this is now a problem. Having that burnt would have been nice. I need this, because I'm just going to sack something. Don't really know why. It's a speed type with this, so this is pretty annoying to deal with. Uh, I guess I could have kept this a bit better, but it was it was useful for the hitman top. 
and and this. I guess I'll go to this. Just uh, just sacking it. Sorry, Santa Kamba. But uh, it is how it is how it is. And I have no other option to like raise the speed time. And there we go. I think it's a speed time, right? 295, yeah. So that was lucky of me. Uh, you know, <laughs> what can you do? <laughs> that was my only way out and I went for it. I may as well forfeit it if I miss this. <laughs> Here's the ninjask. Uh, quite threatening. Still. I'll try to go for a knockoff quickly, as it fails, of course. Uh, this could be over, but uh, we'll see. Can't really switch this in. I don't really need this too much, though. Yeah, she goes for acrobatics, but doesn't have, still has the item, so I can get a huge damage in. A huge sash, anyways. Uh, I don't really think I need this. Yeah, it is dangerous though. I'm hoping I could take a. He doesn't have a, a attack boost. Uh, he just put. Oh, maybe he put himself in range without protect. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Acrobatic is pretty strong, and I'm and I'm just uh, offensive, so may as well die. Thirty-eight percent is quite a lot though. Get into the deciding factor. Oh, that doesn't kill. Awesome. All right. And here I die, and I guess I'll just go for Arctivish first. Uh, yeah, being as powerful as possible. Do damage. Almost one Hikayo in Phalanx. Oof. Like, I don't know, is this... I, I should be faster. Never mind. Both died, and I guess we'll just do this. Uh... Hmm. Citrus Berry. I think Shadow Ball is too strong. I don't think I'll be able to win. But we'll see. I get an extra burn. Why not? See Pain Splits. Not sure why he's not attacking. But uh, I think a Shadow Ball should be more than enough. I'm faster, which is kind of annoying. Oh boy. Maybe he has Hex and it's over. Yeah, it seems like it's Hex, right? Yeah. GG. That was a pretty good battle. Uh, I think the last turns I should have maybe brought this first. Hmm, I don't know. It's still good to see the power of Artovish though. That was great. Just I think I think the last turns have played bad. Instead of bringing Artovish, I think I was too rushy with it. Oh shit! I'm almost always a problem for my team. But uh, apart from that, I think that's pretty much it. Like, like yeah. I like Rotom, to be honest. I like Scon Tank. Uh, he has two, has two Brand types, though. I'll go, I'll, I'll go with it. Leave with this. Because here goes the Pika. They don't have HPIs this gen. So I'm going to send a Combat's defensive one. Tank. I'll go for Rocks. Seems like this is good. I can knock off my lefties. It's a bit sad, but we still have the recover. And just a Glare. Right, we can clear the Obama snow. It's always awesome. Because the problem with this Pokemon is usually the speed he's got at this tier. But now that he's like neutralized, uh, I feel good. We're going to Scar Tank. We resist his Grass type. We can take. Oh, he's physical. Hold on. <laughs> or maybe mixed. I think he's switching. I think he's not. Uh, I can just go for. Uh, I'll go for a flamethrower. Quite weak to this. It's Dark Trio. Nah, I think I'll go for Dark Balls. Oh fuck, he's state. What the fuck? I'll get the Paraflames anyways, but come on. Shouldn't have never have state. I guess he's paralyzed and he just wants to die, but I don't know. I guess it had still priority and utility for me. Now here comes this beast. Oh my god. Hail, one to four turns. I think once this is done, I think I can just go for uh, for this, do a bit of damage. Sadly, he's not using uh, yeah moves with uh, what's it called? 
contact moves. Yes. So that's a bit of a problem. Can we just bait some sort of attack? Like this, and then switch out to the ghost type and hope we can play one turn at least of the hail. Life orb. Rebreak. And now we go for a will o wisp, trying to take this. We do take it, and we burn him. Two more turns. Now I'll just go. See if this is not gonna heal me much. I'll just go to this. If he predicts it, well, well done. He goes for the like neutral play, I guess. The hail stops. Oh, now I'm definitely faster. We can just go for a nice. Powerful features, friend. Get rid of the vertic. I think we, we did play around it decently well, I think. Our physical wall is almost done, which is very sad. And I don't think I can recover on anything, but. Uh, what can you do? <laughs> Something had to stop it. I'm still quite afraid of the Valamar. But I do have Sock. Um, I can do a lot of heavy damage before he sets up with the superpower, so maybe we can do that a bit. <laughs> I think I know how to do it. So one, on the turn he goes to superpower, I'll keep this ghost type, so he can never get any boost. And once he kills it, uh, what? <laughs> Definitely not what I was expecting. Pikachu, the dog's real Lola, even. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know he was a sub. I'll just give him a heart. Well, Fisher's red. It's uh, very unfair, but he sets up the sun. Does these do anything? He's just, like, faster, which is ultra sad. But I think Sandaconda can take a bit. Spam Earthquake? I kind of want Sandaconda, though. Let's go to Rotom. Have it just perish. Have it ever from perish. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's a lot of rain. Hopefully, you can not see it. Why don't you record and you? I did. I'm, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> so, we avoid the sucker punch. Kind of. Cool. <laughs> uh. I'm honestly just want this to die. Yeah, there you go. And now we bring the other Scarfer. And I think we are decent. <laughs> God damn it. You're not losing terribly. It's good stuff. Alright, let's do damage. Do I need this? No, I'll go to the ghost first. As I said before. Does it does it do anything though? Oh, maybe I can take a superpower after, yeah. That that makes sense. Chase cuffed. Ah, uh, there we go. So we have we went for psycho cut. Uh, so I think I'm good. Uh, He's scoffed, so he's gonna be faster than me, sadly. Let's go into this. Go for quakes. If he stays in and I can de and I can get damage, that'd be beautiful. But he sacks the Pika. And I will just paralyze him. <laughs> he's gonna take a lot of a uh, lot of recoil damages, which is unfortunate. Now, I don't want this to set up much, but uh, I do need to weaken it as much as possible. Oh, that does a lot of damage. Wow. Good job, Santa Condor. I definitely on speed now. He will be in range of close combat. GG, man. Yeah. I can even go to this.
All right, we got it. A victory. Uh, <laughs> Dashnor, come on, <laughs> be nice. <laughs> That's a GG. We can get <laughs> we can get more battles. And see how this goes. Oh, that's a very ghost intense team, which is quite a problem. Okay, leading with Skunk Tank. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. Maybe he tries to burn me, thinking I'm physical. That'd be beautiful. All the Mawals could be in. And there we go. With a lot of damage to Kofang. I should we get dragged out and burned. Oh, never mind. Oof. <laughs> I'm going back to this. Is this just lead, sack lead? It certainly do, does look like it. Oh, so he goes into his own. Is he black sludge? No. More red card. He's not getting the things in. <laughs> I like I like this. Oh boy. It's nasty plot. I do like this too. Now this is unfortunate. Because he would have done a bit of damage. But I am AV. So he didn't do that much. Oh, but it's just... Bro. <laughs> it's a flinch shed. Okay. Now we go for the sucker punch. The reveal! Now he's stench, so I went for this without getting worried. So all around, I think it worked pretty well. If we could get this flinch now, that would be beautiful. And we do. And I think that's... That's that's too good for me. Skogtech! Being a boss. Alright. He finally goes into this, which is a problem, I must say. Uh, he's gonna set up rocks. So I'll take this opportunity to just go offensive, Octavius first. I see Mr. Stone Edge, he's missing all the moves. Sorry mate, but this is not very fair for you. Yeah. Corsola comes in, I'll just do damage. Because this is Sash. He's gonna probably burn me? Earth power. Weird. Uh, can I just sack Rotom? Endure, huh? That's what I thought. But we can take this barely, but we can. Down goes this. Quite a cool set. I really like it. Was it Tommy that used it? Uh, I think I just go for shock. I can have. I have uh, both moves that can hurt him. As he goes into Mawile first. So I'm out of here. I'm going to go into Sanda. Sandy Condi. Take a bit of damage from this. Set of rocks. See Iron Head's flinches. Oh no. Oh, he didn't flinch. Awesome. <laughs> I stayed to hurt this. Uh, I'm not going for. Oh, never mind. I wasn't going for the rest because I was just worried that he just SD, right? So yeah. Go into this. Just go for a Willow. If he switches. Getting the willow on, 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 on fucking Trevor is good, but he decides to stay in. So everything's working pretty nicely for me at this point. Must say, oh, the fire blast tech! Almost got me with that. Almost got me with that. Uh, no, I want to keep this. Honestly, I'll just I think I'll sack this. If I die. Then so be it. That still does some damage. Yeah. Probably the more than seed bomb. All right. Uh, so now we got this. Sucker punch. We take. There we go. Here comes the Trev. Uh, I guess I just take him. I don't really care if he kills me or what he does. He's gonna spam this attack. Hopefully he doesn't have enough for a shot, but he does have the citrus anyway. Gotta face this demonic set. I uh, really hate it. I'm gonna spam knockoff until I get rid of the berry. It's gonna work. You know, I'm choice too. So even if you do this... Uh, yeah. He does have... Uh, he has eaten the thing, but... Oh, never mind. Citrus berry is gone. So now he cannot win. And with the process, he commits to Doku, GG. <laughs> uh, good job, Sock. Well done. I need that set, was very, very annoying, but with spamming knockoff, you beat it until... Uh, even if you get burned, it's my last Pokemon anyways. So, why wouldn't I? Last battle! 
a lot of stops to my mods, that's for sure. Oh, Rotom is a problem, is it? It really be a problem. Living failure, living failure lead. Santa Conda lead. I think I like Santa Conda lead. No, I don't. I go for shock. You know, I'm gonna be offensive. I don't like that his my choice mods have like so many good switchings. <laughs> but I guess it is what it is. I'll just go offensive, lead with shock, and see what happens. So I don't think this these sometimes run earthquake, but not always. So maybe I can sneak a kill. I think that's good. I think the common set doesn't have it, right? We can have a look. I think it runs Stone Edge. Oh, yeah. Oh no, it does have it does run it this gen. Makes sense. This is the road of the yeah. So he does scout for it, but at Ball Breaker, as I showed you, I'll go for another one. Like, I am faster than this. It says it first turn, dude. <laughs> How much damage we could do to Alcrimi? He's very tanky, defensively. So we have to get out of there. Uh, if he's a call mind set, that's quite a problem. We may want to pair this set of rocks. I'll do it. Ooh, that does damage. Go for rocks first. I'm pretty sure I should be faster. I have some speed. I doubt his max speed. There you go. See, I see armor. That's okay. I plan on killing him with uh, sludge bombs at this point. So I'll just para him. I see call mine. See, that's that sucks. But I did well in paralyzing him. Yeah, it does much damage as possible, spamming this. Dazzling Gleam, whatever. Yeah, that does okay damage. And that's why we paralyzed him. It's, it's very sad, but it's like my way out of this. Although these kind of sweepers are very passive, so they can get crit and hexed pretty easily. Uh, oh, that's not even close. We'll see though. It's gonna be long, but I don't think I can do much against this. Yeah. Ooh. There we go. And if we can get the crit now, <laughs> it will be beautiful. Ah, we're gonna be here a while. I'm wasting some recovers, I guess. I can't believe I'm not getting any crits too. It sucks. Alright, he missed. That's, that's crit rage. He's sort of recovered again. Nope. Okay. Come on. <laughs> oh! Ay! Damn it. If I don't get a crit, I'll lose. Or the Paris. Uh, maybe. It's quite incredible I didn't get any. But it is what it is. He's getting a lot uh, paralyzed a lot though. Come on. Nope. I just need it. No crit. That's pretty incredible. I usually usually you get crits when this kind of sets uh, happen, but uh, not me. Shut the tower. He didn't even make the move. <laughs> I get. I have like no other strategy so far. Ten recovers. There we go. Come on, do it. 
It's time. It's time, Scum Tank. Nope. Well. I just hope he kills me now. Four <laughs> percent. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Uh, but he's gonna attack and kill. I need this to, like, kill... I really can't win against this. Uh, he did set up quite too early. I can get uh, like crits, but uh, that's it. I don't think even a crit with uh, with P jab is gonna be enough. But we'll see. I was hoping it would not be this dual set because it kind of breaks my team, but uh, it is what it is. Yeah, the, the, yeah, my option was to get the crit here. There you go. GG. And that's that's the strip. Damn. Let's get our last one. Gonna be sad to run on this. Okay. Let's do this as the last one. Oh, another Alcrabi. Oh, no. No! Let's try it though. This suck pretty good lead, I'd say. Although these have sash. Hmm. Sandic combo is very nicer. Yeah. We got some earthquake. He seem, seems to be kind of weak to it. I have Shed King, so I'm good. I'll go for rocks too. There you go. We can rest this turn. I don't know why she's staying in with this, but I guess it's working because I'm not waking up. Come on. And he doesn't have like many good switches to this, to be honest. No? Well, do it again! <laughs> Since he get out too, he KO me. Guess it is what it is, huh? Come on. Shed skin. It's like 30% they told. Another one. He has toxic, so I don't want to go to my grass type. This is my best play. I just need to get that scald burn, you know, if you feel me. Bro. Well, I'm wasting a lot of earthquakes, though. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Such a lame battle. Now I am being passive and risking the crit. There we go. Finally. Oh, there's the memento. Sure. All right. Now we gotta be fast here. There we go. That's okay. As long as he doesn't set up, I'm good. Expecting Toxic Crow, I'll go for the flame moves. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that fucking did so much damage though. As he has these. Oh, he's. I know. I mean, fucking not as the. I don't know. God damn it, what the fuck? Dude. Yeah, of course you kill. She goes into this now. That does so much damage. I'm not used to seeing this damage. <laughs> Run him. That's pretty good damage, actually. I, I like it. He cannot switch again easy with that. And, oof. Yeah, he's super offensive. And he might be, if he's Scarf, <laughs> he can outspeed. Well, I think he regular has, outspeeds me, actually. This thing's super fast. So I'll let this die. Go back into this. I go for P jabs. 
I think you're going to outcrow me. I think they're just choice. What? Well, got a crit. And a poison. Very nice. Yeah, he, he was choice. That has to be like bandit. I don't know what that was, but uh, yeah. Not cool. Go to Santa Cotta, just kind of sack. See what he does. Rock polish, yeah. I think we can para the ground types. Pretty sure we can. We could not take a critical hit. So that's good. I think we lose now. Oh, never mind. <laughs> what the fuck is this battle? I can't basically reveal that I'm scoffed. So bad. Uh, struggle for damage. Don't need this too much. And he goes for a nasty plot anyways, so. Keep going for knockoff, weakening him. And I hope he doesn't have vacuum whim. Haha! -ha! He will have it. Maybe he's greedy though. Maybe he is greedy. He does have vacuum whim. GG! That was a, a, way, a way better battle, at least. Because, you know. Even if I lost, like, doesn't matter by the way, this outspeeds me and this uh, kills me, I cannot kill in one hit. At least, you know, it's just, uh, you know, we had some plays, he did some plays to get in this position, and uh, the setup was too much. So I, I think we can end it up on this, uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time for more tier changes and other videos on this channel. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. See you friends!